Hey there, YouTube. Yeah, wife and I decided to get out and do a little shooting, get a little target practice. Guys, it doesn't do a damn bit of good if you own a firearm and it sits in your closet. You know, yeah, you can sit there and say you got this, that, and the other. Doesn't mean shit if you can't hit your target. Well, anyway, we're going to have some fun. And guys, you want to practice with the holster you're going to be wearing. Um, you know, you could have all the most high-tech shit in the world, but if you don't know how it works, how it operates, you know, what good's it going to do? You know, you see all these tactical videos. Now, if something goes down, it's going to go down when you're not wearing body armor. You're not going to be having a low ride tactical holster or any of that high speed shit you're going to be carrying concealed or open depending on your state you know or how you prefer personally i carry concealed so is my wife but guys hell get out to the range or in this case we're actually on our property in just what we call the scrap yard because we got just landfill and all kinds of crap here but practice 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 with the firearms you're using right now I'm carrying a Springfield Armory XDS 45 a uh, buddy of mine his hands are so big he, he doesn't like it my wife's carrying a SIG SIG P238 238 which is 380 you know, it's good for her. It doesn't really matter the size of the round, guys. You got to be able to hit your target. That's what it comes down to. Practice, you know, quick fire drills, um, aim for center mass, because tell you what, bad guy ain't going to care. You know, and carrying concealed, you maintain the element of surprise. You know, I carry mine pretty close to my wallet. Um, probably about the five o'clock position. Right now, I'm probably sitting at about the three o'clock position. Just practice with whatever you're comfortable with. Um, that's all I can really say about that. But till next time. Hey guys. And another thing when shooting, clearing your firearm. Um, I'm gonna show you how I do it. Uh, it was actually one of our drivers uh, a couple years back. Claimed he cleared his firearm and then shot himself in the damn leg. So I've got a seven round magazine. I'm gonna fire off the seven and lock and clear it. And I'm sorry guys, bullets don't magically appear in the chamber. magazine check the chamber there's nothing in there weapons clear now how this guy managed to get a bullet in there after that is beyond me he didn't properly clear his weapon these ladies and gentlemen don't just appear in the chamber I'm sorry it doesn't work that way and my sidearm has no safety on it you are your own safety you are responsible for yourself I mean if you shoot yourself in the leg or the ass it all falls on you be safe